Hey there, Lions fans. Ash Thompson from DetroitLionsPodcast.com here asking the burning question we all have. Is that my cat's butt? Yes, it is. Also, should the Lions can or keep Larry Warford? In Warford's final press availability, he said he loves the guys he plays with, he loves the organization, but he stopped well short of saying he's not going to go on the open market. The Lions drafted Graham Glasgow and Joe Dahl last year, and they improved as the year went on, solidifying the depth in the interior offensive line a great deal. The Lions have options also with their first round draft pick from a couple years ago, Lakin Tomlinson, bailing completely on the left side of the line and looking like a more natural fit in the one game Warford did actually miss this year. The choice comes down to either Riley Reef or Larry Warford. Realistically speaking, the Lions don't have the cap space to spend a lot of money on both of those players. Warford is solid in the pass and run, ranks very highly in pro football focus. I know how much Lions Redditors love that particular website, but in this case it does bear out. He is very good in the pass and run, and he plays the cheaper position of the two, which makes him a little bit more likely of a signing in my opinion. The Lions are only 15th in the NFL in cap space, so they need their cost versus the impact of the player to match up very well. And assuming Lakin Tomlinson is going to slide over to the right side and stop being awful, has some pretty grave consequences for Matthew Stafford if it's not true. I think the Lions are going to hold on to Larry Warford this year for that reason. Subscribe and like below. You'll read this and many other quality items at DetroitLionsPodcast.com.